think success for a pediatric hospitalist is really connecting with individual patients and families. Um, I think success for a pediatric hospitalist is being able to do great teaching with your residents, with your medical students, to give them a piece of knowledge that they never had before. I think success also looks like being able to take a deeper dive into something that you're really, really passionate about. And sometimes those really small projects can become something much larger and much more meaningful. Um, so I think those are all things that bring us success at the end of the day. We get to be diagnosticians, which is a really fun place to be. You know, you get a kid with a fever for 14 days and you don't know why. We're the people that get to take care of them and figure out what's going on and, um, you know, put that family's mind at ease and help them through that process. Occupation has grown a ton just even in the last 10 years because it was never a thing, right? So pediatricians used to see their patients in the hospital when they were sick. And then, you know, people discovered that pediatricians didn't have enough time to go into the hospital and see their patients. And these patients were sick enough that they needed somebody there all the time. And so the pediatric hospitalist position grew as somebody who just only sees those sick kids in the hospital. We don't have a clinic, so we're always in the hospital. Pediatric hospital medicine is incredibly diverse, so you get to take care of um, newborn babies, um, complex specialty patients in the hospital, and even some of the sickest kids in the hospital and the intensive care unit. So I really like the variety. We became a subspecialty this past year, and so now we have a board certification specific for pediatric hospital medicine, which wasn't around before this past year. Our group in particular has played a role in a subspecialty-based hospital where every year we seem to take on more services onto our team. So um, teams that used to have their own services in the hospital now are taken care of on our team and we work collaboratively with those subspecialists to take care of their patients. So for pediatric hospitalists, it's a two-year fellowship. So um, it is gonna be a strong clinical service, both on the main teaching service at Riley, but also doing a lot of rotations in other areas that are complementary to pediatric hospitalists, such as working in the intensive care unit, working on things like pediatric sedation, which a lot of times residents don't get a lot of experience um, uh, as a pediatric resident, so the hospitalist really helps to add to that. In addition to that, you'll have your own project that you'll work on as, as a fellow, and you will um, be able to participate in other QI projects um, that other folks in the group are working on. We definitely uh, want our fellows to do research and we expect them to do research. A lot of the research that we do is either education-based or quality improvement based. Just because of the nature of being hospitalists, that's more of the research that we do. But if our fellows want to come in and do you know, retrospective chart reviews or dive deeper into research outside of QI or education, then we want to foster that as much as possible. Our fellows on our service do a lot of teachings. As a hospitalist, you can easily fit into that role as a fellow. So we let our fellows be pretty autonomous when they're rounding during the day. So when they're on service, they are leading the team. They are teaching our residents and our students as they go through rounds. They also go through programs to learn more about education. And so they learn about different teaching techniques, they'll do talks with them, and they become very engaged with education. The fellows that come out, um, they really come out with um, a great deal of confidence and skills in not just the clinical side, which a lot of times they already had great experience in, but really what are the other experiences that help to round out um, what it means to be um, a hospital-based pediatrician.